Thank you for the question. The governor's response has disappointed me. He has played politics, for example, by not including important input from the state superintendent of schools, by excluding her from key meetings. Governor Bullock has not been judicious and timely in the dispensing of the federal dollars allotted us, and again, appearing to play politics with these community rescuing funds. If each individual deposits the ballot in certified United States Postal Service or county election ballot receptacles, I believe they are secure. It's irresponsible to add a sales tax on top of our other taxes. We need to lessen the burden for the citizens of Montana. I do not support legalizing recreational marijuana. I did not originally support it as written. There were not enough sideboards to guard against the misuse. The reforms put into place requiring asset evaluation and other protective administrative measures I can support and have supported and Montanans can be assured I will always honor all aspects of both our state and our United States constitutions, protect the individual, the family, property rights, gun rights, our opportunities to thrive in labors of our choosing, and any other opportunity we deem in our liberty. Crime and drug use are top of mind with so many people. Cascade County has an exceptionally high involvement with illicit drugs and the inappropriate use of legal drugs. This is impacting every aspect of the lives of the population of our county. I have had six previous years serving in the House of Representatives. I have a Bachelor of Science degree in management. As the mother of seven children, I want you to know it takes a tremendous amount of organization and a variety of people management skills, as well as um, juggling uh, all of the requirements and opportunities that those children and people present and I have well prepared myself to be a representative and to serve uh, the people in House District 19.